welcome back to my channel. Today I'm filming a long overdue haul. This is November and December. Technically I use my Sephora haul as my November haul and now I'm just going to film a December haul and show you guys everything I picked up in the last couple of weeks of 2018. But since I want to share all the love, I have some giveaways going on on my channel. So you guys might have seen these little black bags in my videos. They contain an assortment of makeup things and I would love to mail it to one of you guys. So I will go ahead and leave the rules in the comments, in a pinned comment, and you guys go ahead and enter and I will send it to one of my lucky subscribers. So anyway, without further blabbering, let's get into it. So the first thing I want to show you guys, I got my Paulina palette. I did film this look. So if it is up, I will go ahead and try to remember to link it in the cards. So excited for Paulina, so excited to have that palette. Anything you see in this video, if you want to see a review or swatches or anything, just let me know down in the comments and I will film that for you if I haven't already. I also picked up the new guys from Pinky Rose. I was not expecting this to launch and I'm so happy they did because they are gorgeous and I cannot wait to play with these some more. I also picked up the Berries and Cream palette. This one I picked up on Black Friday because she was doing free shipping. Here is what the inside of this palette looks like. And I love the outside packaging as well. I also picked up the Alamar palettes, the Arena del Caribe eyeshadow volume one and two. She recently launched palette number two and I had never tried the first one so I just bit the bullet and bought both. Also picked up the Alien palette by Jeffree Star. I don't know when this came out and I'm actually not sure if I've already put this in a haul, but that is what the inside of this palette looks like. So stunning. I also bought the ColourPop Chasing Rainbows palette. This is their holiday palette. It's okay. This might also end up on Poshmark in case you guys keep an eye out. This is the Salvage palette. This was their collab with Becky G. This is also by ColourPop. It's okay. Kind of over the whole ColourPop thing. This is the Tribe palette by Juvia's Place. This is honestly one of my favorite palettes of 2018. So unique. I have a review on this. I will link it up in the cards if you guys are interested. Plastic things. This is a lippy I picked up from the ColourPop probably in here somewhere. Tom Ford quad. This is African Violet. They're back here somewhere. I picked these up during the VIB sale. So here's African Violet and here is Photosynthesis. I haven't tried Photosynthesis on my eyes yet. Oops. This is the box for the Charlotte Tilbury Chic to Chic in the box does not say that is rude. Uh, this is the lip cheat in Pillow Talk. I bought the Pillow Talk collection. This is the lipstick in Pillow Talk. I just have the boxes for everything. This is Miss Dr. M. I'm just gonna toss all these. Mood Crayons by Linda Hallberry. The Metallic Mysteries eyeshadow palette. I think I'm going to declutter this. More Tom Ford quad boxes. This is the Marc Jacobs brush. I got this brush during Black Friday. It was 40% off, the bronzer brush, otherwise I would never have bought this. I've already showed it a few times on my channel. Picked up this little set of the Urban Decay Primer Portion Potion. I'm already using this and so I'm gonna toss that. Got this little Dominique Cosmetics lip gloss. I'm gonna throw this in a giveaway for you guys. This is the Advanced Snail Mucin Power Essence. I picked this up after watching the Half Cousins podcast where Lacey talked about this. Morphe liquid lipsticks. I picked up a whole bunch more shades after I talked about the original two I picked up. Here's more. Here's Jeffree Star Karma packaging. Here's more. Here's kind of the lippies I picked up. These are the Becky G ones. This is Make Believe. This is a 
pretty periwinkle color I've been meaning to wear. This is the Melt Eyeliner I picked up during their Black Friday sale in the shade 420. This sucks, so I'm going to sell that or declutter it. This is Karma. You guys have seen this on me. This is the packaging for the Mood Crayons. Putting that in my packaging hoarding box. This is my BH bronzer box. I've been wearing the bronzer. Love this. I won't be keeping the packaging. More Becky G packaging. This I actually got for Christmas from my husband's stepsister. It's the It Cosmetics brushes. Super cute. They're super, super shiny. I wouldn't have bought these for myself, so I'm glad she bought them for me. It's definitely something you can never have too many of is the brushes. And I've heard really, really good things about the ones from It Cosmetics. Let me show these to you. Here's what they look like. Wow. Yeah, they're like really in there. Ooh, this is nice. I think I'm gonna use these. Let's grab them out of the packaging here. They're in there pretty freaking tight. <laughs> Holy smokes, these are so pretty. Wow. So, I don't know if you guys got these for Christmas, but I did. Also comes with this cute little pouch to put your brushes in. I got the Melt Smoke Sessions palette. This was one I wasn't planning on buying, but when I saw that it launched, I had to. This formula is weird. The shadows are like coming out of the pans. So Melt's got something funky going on with their formula, but I do love this palette so, so much. I also picked up some Angelica merch. I need to wear this shirt. It is called Who Asked For This? Super cute. It's like an off-shoulder deal. I found this and I want to feature it in an affordable makeup video. These are the Profusion palettes. Picked up a few of those from my local Target, so look for a video on those. This is a lip gloss called Flesh Fantasy from Papa Grab. I love that. This is another lip balm from her in the shade Love Supreme. Keeping that. This is the red um, called Hot Shot from Morphe. Keeping that. I also got new Wet n Wild stuff. I filmed a separate haul on this and this I have in this container because I want to film a video with all of these. So that will go back there. This is so not everything, you guys. I'm so sorry I'm all over the place, but I try to keep track and it's so hard to do, especially with the holidays. So 2019, it's going to be better. Here's Dr. M by ColourPop. Been into the really weird lip colors. Picked up a backup of this Beauty Water, Sauna and Park from Sephora. I have one now upstairs in my bathroom because I love that so much. I picked up some Ulta Z palettes. These are my favorite ones to put my single eyeshadows in. So if you're looking for some, you can usually get that buy two, get two free. Picked up these palettes from Ulta, so I will be featuring them in a video soon, but they are now available on ColourPop's website. Also picked up this palette. So excited for this one from ColourPop. I have the Christmas Morning Palette by Give Me Glow. Already reviewed that for you guys. Zodiac Love Signs. This is also a new launch from BH Cosmetics. Super duper cute. Need to review that for you guys. And then finally, the Snow Angels Palette by Joseph Colors. I wanted this during Black Friday, but I didn't want to pay for shipping. And then I found it on sale on... Ulta, so I bought it on Ulta's website, and I will definitely do a look with this for you guys as well, because I am excited to try it out. So that is it for my December haul. It was obnoxiously long. I do apologize, and I hope to buy less makeup in 2019. So thank you guys for watching, and I will catch you soon. Bye!